Fox 44 weather forecast with Weather Rage certified meteorologist Emily Kay. Well, the weather's the end, the, you know, the New Year's <laughs> ending, and so is the good weather going away with it. Absolutely, Kendall. Just like I've been saying, New Year, new weather. Much like New Year, new me. I'm sorry, everyone. These jokes will be over tomorrow. It'll be okay. <laughs> but again, new weather coming in tomorrow. Rain is starting to come into the area. We've been seeing mostly sunny skies all week. We've been seeing beautiful weather. We do have a high pressure in the area, but if you can take a look right now, you can actually see it starting to move out of the area. So this high pressure earlier was centered more over Waco. Here it goes. It's sliding out. Going to be completely out of the area by later on tonight, and that's when that rain's going to start to move on in, and that's where we're going to start to see those mostly cloudy skies as well. Mostly clear skies right now, so your New Year's Eve plans, nothing to worry about tonight. You don't have to grab the umbrella. Just make sure you grab the jacket because it is a little chilly out there, but again, no rain for tonight. Rain tomorrow, however. By this time tomorrow, we'll start to see more showers moving through the area. Highs today got into the upper 50s, lower 60s. Beautiful weather to round out 2019. Exactly where we're supposed to be for this time of year. We'll be seeing these temperatures continuing by the end of the week, but tomorrow we're starting 2020 off just a little chilly. Temperatures right now dropping down into the mid 40s across most of the area. College Station just a tad bit warmer in the upper 40s down there, continuing to fall down as we go throughout the rest of the night. But again, calm conditions throughout the rest of your New Year's Eve. Uh, winds coming in from the north about five to ten miles per hour, bringing in that nice, cool, and dry air out there, feeling absolutely wonderful. And those temperatures continuing to fall. So take a look at the future cast for the rest of your night. Right around midnight, bringing in the New Year with temperatures. Temperatures around the mid 40s, mostly clear skies. And then going into tomorrow morning, the clouds start to filter back in. 2020 looking a little dreary to start it off. Again, mostly cloudy skies for your Wednesday morning. Temperatures starting off in the lower 40s, upper 30s, and then warming up into the mid 50s to lower 50s right around lunchtime. Clouds really across most of the area. And this is when a lot of us will start to see those showers moving into the area. Showers more likely down near College Station. 50 degrees near College Station right around 3 o'clock. Highs getting into the mid 50s by tomorrow afternoon and then dropping back down into the 40s by tomorrow evening. And that's when the rain really starts to move through again down near College Station, up near Waco. Rain not quite as uh, common throughout your Thursday, but overall showers and storms possible over the next two days. Temperatures getting into the 50s by Thursday morning. That's what we'll wake up to on Thursday. And then temperatures getting back into the mid-60s by later Thursday afternoon. So this is right around lunchtime. Not warming up much more by Thursday afternoon, but overall 60s sticking around for most of your Thursday. Thursday night, however, will start to clear out. And your Friday looking absolutely gorgeous. Overnight tonight, temperatures getting into the 30s. Increasing cloud cover going into tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, 2020, 53 degrees. Mostly cloudy skies. That 20% chance of showers by the afternoon. Not all of us will see the rain, but the rain is possible tomorrow. For your seven-day forecast, beautiful. Temperatures getting back into the 60s by next year. Temperatures in the mid-60s over the weekend, mostly sunny skies. Wednesday and Thursday, really, the only days that we'll be seeing those mostly cloudy skies and that 30% uh, chance, not 20, 20% tomorrow, 30% on Thursday, uh, chance of rain. But that 70 forecast for Bryan College Station, just a tad bit warmer, and also that chance of rain is just a little better on Wednesday and Thursday as well. Uh, rain more likely down near Bryan and College Station on Wednesday and Thursday. But look at the next, like, six days. Mostly sunny skies, absolutely gorgeous. And then again, getting into the upper 60s by the end of the weekend. Beautiful weather. Those lows really starting off in the 50s and then getting back into the 30s. So, kind of a roller coaster ride as far as the lows are concerned. But overall, seven day forecast, I've seen much worse. I am here for the seven day forecast. It's going to be yeah. beautiful to start off the year.